Hey guys, it's me and today we're going to be doing another trading tips video, so I'll get straight into it. You probably want at least 30k for this, and more than 50k would probably work better, but you can use all amounts of coin really, so we'll get straight into it. So first I'll show you how to do it. What you're going to want to do is go to gold, and then basically for this, what you're going to do is you're going to be searching for center attacking mids that have been converted to center mids or maybe even center defensive mids depending on how good their defending stats are. So you're probably going to be looking for players such as Steven Gerrard, Frank Lampard, Modric and lesser known players such as Menez, Gorkouf, Eduardo and people like that. So what you can do is go to the ultimate database and then when you're there go to search center attacking mid position and usually I like to put in a bit of pace so 75 say and 75 shooting. There are players with less pace that are popular too, such as Lampard, as I've mentioned, but the vast majority of these camps that are being converted are probably going to be these ones, which are with a good bit of pace and shooting. So you can see any of these players here, really, most of the players under 10k work well. The ones over 10k work well too. Obviously, they have bigger profit margins, but the ones under 10k will have a bit of value added on as well. So if you don't have that much coins, you're probably going to be want to use the less expensive ones. So yeah, any of one of these, such as Diego, you could use Nazri, or Modric, or anyone like that. So I'm going to pick out Adel Terrapt. He's usually pretty okay for me. Go to Barclays Premier League and QPR. Max price 5,000, but I don't think, yeah, there's none on the market. So what I'm going to do is going to search a specific formation. Usually you want to search good formations for that league. So I think 4 3 2 is a pretty good formation for the BPL. And you can see this guy for 5.5k. And the next highest one, I believe, is 7.3k, if I remember correctly. I'm just looking at it on a preview screen. So that's a pretty good 1.5k profit if you sell them on for 7k. Not including tax, of course, but that's a pretty decent small profit to start off with. And that's only the first player that I searched, so... Obviously, if you keep going, you're going to find more and more bargains. So, yeah, that's basically how you do this method. I'll now move on to some examples of me using it. So, I'll see you in the next part of the video. So, hey guys, I'm back, and this is my trade feed. As you can see, I've won a few players recently and been outbid before that. And you can see I've purchased quite a few players recently. So, I'll move right on. And in the watches, you can see I have a couple of players that I can't sell at the moment because I've still got bids on them. And you can just ignore these Adebayor, Mandanda, and Munats because they're not part of this video. So, first up, we have the second name for Belhanda. And I probably sell him on for about 20k because he was converted from a cam position. And I do believe I sell him on for about that later on. And we've got a few Madrishes there Schneider, Schweinsteiger. And I've got quite a few Gerards. I found quite a few of these guys for cheap. And you can see quite a cheap price there. And in CDM, Gerard works well in most positions on the field, apart from, say, Striker, because he's got pretty good all-round stats. He's got a Nazri, a Pastore, a Goetze, a Kigawa in a center defensive mid position. Picked him up for pretty, pretty cheap, 2.6k, I believe, which is about what the normal version is almost going for now, or the Borussia Dortmund version is, I believe. So you've got Menez, Gorkouf, Eduardo, Honda, and you can see the Liga and the Russian League are pretty great for this tactic because they have quite a lot of cams that people want to use, such as Honda, Danny, and Menez. And you've got a Adel Terraf picked up for cheap, and Alameda. Wasn't sure about this guy, and I don't think I'll be able to sell him out for much more, to be honest. But I'll move on. So here are the sales. And you can see so quite a few players have sold. Sold that Bell Handon for 90.5. And so the couple of Modric's on for just under 15k, Schneider for no, just under 19, and you can see I'm making quite a decent profit on most of these players. Usually I aim to make at least 2k, and better deals would usually make me about 4k. So if you fill up your trade pile with pretty good deals that say give you about 3k profit, including tax, that will net you just under a 100k profit, which is a pretty sweet profit for. About 40 minutes training you can do this in, that's usually how long it takes me to find pretty good deals. And I believe in this session I've probably made about 60k, approximately. I'm waiting for a couple of cards to sell, this Kevin Fritz Boateng, he's sold just there, 
So another six. Gerard in a poor formation. Gorkouf in an unpopular formation for the league. Huh? And Lamela, who I didn't really expect to sell for that much. I was hoping for him to, but he couldn't really expect that much. So I think I'm going to have to lower the price on him. But yeah, this technique works really, really well for me. And hopefully, hopefully it's given you a few ideas on how to trade better. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please leave it a like if you did. And apart from that, I will talk to you all next time.